Imagine if I told you the secret behind the mobile phone you are holding, the smartwatch around your wrist, the laptop, and even the electric car is a single element called lithium. Yes, that's right. All of these tech wonders are powered by the wonder element lithium. How does that happen? What exactly is lithium? And how this lithium is used to make the lithium ion batteries? It's called the white gold. Why? This lithium is nowadays trending in India. What's the reason behind that? And how the discovery of 5.9 million tons of lithium in Jammu and Kashmir will impact the growth of India's semiconductor industry? Hold on, no confusions. In this video, we're gonna answer all of these questions. Assalamu alaikum guys, we're so thrilled to have you back on our YouTube channel. Thanks for tuning in today. And if you haven't subscribed yet, what are you waiting for? Hit that subscribe button and also please share with your friends and enemies as well because everyone deserves good information. So let's get started. Few days back, for the first time, Geological Survey of India has discovered 5.9 million tons of lithium in the Riyasi district of Jammu and Kashmir. Now, after this announcement, India has become the second highest container of lithium globally after Chile, which is located in the South America. Chile has around 9 million tons of this precious white gold. It's called as white gold because in its elemental form, it appears white and it is as precious as gold. So what is the gamma of this lithium? Before understanding the importance of lithium, let's understand what exactly this lithium is. Lithium was discovered in 1817 by John August. Its name is derived from a Greek word lithos, meaning stone. In the periodic table, lithium is present in group 1 and period 2. So its periodic number is 3. Lithium element, it's highly reactive and it never exists in free space. It is always present in the form of compounds. For example, pigmatitic minerals. Now the question is that why this lithium is used to make the batteries since lithium is a metal it's an alkali metal so like any other alkali metals for example hydrogen potassium sodium it has only one valence electron and you know it the elements which have only one electrons valence electrons they can easily lose that valence electron and form a positive ion or called as cation and in that way, lithium is reactive with respect to other elements and it is a good conductor of electricity. And because of the property of the good conductor of the electricity of lithium, it is used to make lithium ion batteries. A lithium ion battery, it is made up of anode, cathode, electrolyte, a separator and two current collectors, positive as well as negative. As you know, the current is basically the flow of electrons from one place to other. So the lithium ion batteries work on the same principle. Basically, these ions, lithium ions, move from the positive electrode anode to a negative electrode or cathode. When this battery is charged, the ions move from the positive uh, electrode or anode to cathode. And when the battery is discharged, these ions move from cathode to anode. Now the question arises, why lithium only is perfect to make the batteries? Why not any other alkali metal, for example, hydrogen, which is available in abundance in the nature, potassium or sodium? Why can't these elements be used to make the batteries? Why only lithium is perfect? 
basically for batteries there are two important things one is called as energy density the other is called as power density energy density is basically the amount of energy that is stored with respect to the mass and power density is the amount of density that can be stored with respect to the mass just like think of it as a as draining a pool for example the more the size of the pool the more amount of water it can contain so the more energy density it has and the greater the speed of draining the water out of the pool the greater will be its power density the same happens with lithium batteries lithium basically has highest energy density than any other other alkali metals and it can store large amount of energy in a small space that is why you see in your homes or in lithium ion batteries that their size is very small but they can store large amount of energy or power and they can give you large amount of electricity and the other advantage of the lithium you know, to in using for the batteries is that lithium has highest melting point at boiling point so that it can you can use it use them in extreme hot or extreme cold temperatures so these properties or advantages of lithium metal make them a perfect fit to make the batteries and lithium ion batteries are so powerful that these batteries can be used in almost every electronic gadget ranging from a smartwatch to an electric vehicle and that is why you might be getting an idea that why the discovery of so much abundant lithium is a big deal for india it is said that everything comes with a negative effect so lithium with all its advantages has a major drawback that it is highly explosive and reactive when lithium reacts with water it forms lithium hydroxide and this lithium hydroxide can be sometimes very explosive and it can produce flames as well so that is the disadvantage of lithium i hope that this video was informative for you if yes please share with other friends as well and hit the bell icon and like this video as well so thanks for tuning in today a big thank you for the team of the ripple of change